Hey guys. Alright, so Overwatch. Overwatch is a single purchase 3D anime inspired graphics with a first person shooter by Blizzard. In this video I'm just going to rant explaining things and giving my thoughts on the features and characters. Okay, so let's begin with the characters. There are currently 21 playable characters. I seriously thought that the game would have major balancing issues due to having so many characters with such different and wacky abilities but Blizzard has managed to make them pretty much even when it comes to power except for Bastion, he is pretty overpowered um, yeah yeah I know what you're going to say, he's easily countered but yeah that, that is true but compared to all of the other heroes he's much stronger every hero, uh, hero has it, his own counter um, about the maps and modes, uh, there are 3 modes and 12 maps currently, which are pretty balanced for bo both sides, except for Temple of Anubis. Um, the defense on Temple of Anubis is very strong because there are too many good corners where Bastion can hide. O overall, I mean overall, the... Health packs are in good positions on every map, so not, not too many complaints there. Now for cosmetics and levels and microtransactions. Um, it's great that Blizzard allowed us to get most of the cosmetic items, except for the Origins editions, and probably other f few rare ones, which will be released in later expansions. Or patches um, in the game for free after buying the game you'll get all the heroes all the characters and you can also get every cosmetic item the leveling system is also well because uh, also well made because you can level up infinitely after you hit like one, I think it was level 100, it re gets reset, and you get like a little star on your character. Um, after every time you level up, you get a cosmetic box, a loot box, or whatever it's called, uh, that will grant you voice lines, skins, victory poses, sprays, and you can feed it, and it will feed your gambling addiction. Come on, everyone wants to open more and more. Uh, you can also buy boxes, but it's important to say that the cosmetics do not help you in any way, gameplay-wise. It's just for looks. Also, I'd like to ha uh, add that the game gives you a 20% XP boost if you're playing with a friend, which is very nice. Okay, enough praising the game. Let's talk about the bad stuff here. Uh, one feature I, I really dislike is the ability to pick a hero that you already have in, in your team. That kind of ruins the whole experience and the team composition. A another thing I dislike about the game is that you have to pay to play. Yes, it's not pay to win, but the whole pay to play wall is a big hurdle to jump over. And not everyone has the money to pay the... The whole thing is both good and bad because Blizzard won't have to worry about making enough money and can focus more on making more maps, heroes, balancing and so on. My final thoughts are Overwatch is, is a game definitely worth buying. Uh, the graphics are colorful and cheerful, the characters are unique, there, there is lore and form of cinematics and texts you can read. Um, the learning curve is not very steep, you can easily jump into the game. Uh, you have to just learn the maps and the health back locations. That, mm, that's about 80% of everything you have to know, other than the abilities and the other small things. So yeah, I hope this helps you decide if you want to buy the game or not. 